One of the most fun glitches to mess around with in Super Mario Sunshine is called the Rocket Storage Glitch. First things first, you'll need to grab a rocket nozzle from one of these red nozzle boxes. With Flood's spray nozzle in use, press and hold L in the GameCube version or ZL in the Switch version to enter sidestep mode and then switch to the rocket nozzle with X. You now need to charge up the rocket nozzle and pay attention to the meter in the bottom right corner. When it reaches near the top of the meter, release L or ZL and if you don't launch up into the air, you've successfully stored one rocket. You can repeat these steps as many times as you like to store as many rockets as you like until you're ready to launch. And in order to do that, switch to the spray nozzle and then holding L or ZL, sidestep off a ledge and you'll be shot up into the air. How many rockets you store determines how high you'll go. Naturally, you'll get amazing views up here and you can even switch to Mario Cam and then dive bomb your way down to the ground. Now, as well as this being a really fun glitch, it's also got its practical uses. For example, in a speed run, it's used to skip climbing the clouds up to Bowser in Corona Mountain. I've even used it to skip using Yoshi in Rico Harbor Episode 8 Yoshi's Fruit Adventure by using a coconut and rocket storage. Yeah, I know, it sounds crazy, but hear me out. You place a coconut at the edge within grabbing distance, then store two rockets, shoot off the ledge, and once in the air, switch in and out of Mario Cam quickly to aim Mario towards the platform with the shine in the cage. Once you land on it, place the coconut next to the cage, and if Mario gets in between the two, he'll actually clip through the cage and you can grab the shine. Gotta be honest, I found this much easier than the way the game intends. Rocket storage is super easy and a lot of fun, and best of all, it can be performed anywhere there's a rocket nozzle up for grabs. I highly recommend you try this one out.